today we're at the Magen Davida Dome Blood Center in Ramla. We're here to tour the facility and to learn about their preparations in the medical field in Israel. And we're also here to dedicate a medicycle that has been donated by our Christian friends around the world. We are just unveiling in a second this uh, uh, motor scooter that already saved the lives of 11 people, even though it's only one week old. Wow, here I see Che donated by the generous donation of the Korean family Manitoba to Daraba. I think the most rewarding thing is the, the pure knowledge that whatever we do is to reach out a helping hand to a person in need. And it's even more fantastic when we learn that it changed their lives and are healing and are getting better. This is the most rewarding thing that any of us feel. I've been working with Christian supporters from Again the Vida Dome for many, many years. So to me, it's already something that, I don't know if the right term is used to, but still we admire it because it's not taken for granted. And this is a very important support because people in Israel not always understand and know how much care, love and concern Christians from all over the world feel towards Israel as a country, to the people of Israel as human beings. And, and this type of support that Magen David Dome is receiving through Christian friends of Magen David Dome, through so many ministries and Christian organizations and so forth, is a lifesaver. Christians from all over the world are our partners in saving lives. They stand shoulder to shoulder with us when we reach out and treat other patients, whether they are, have a heart attack or seizures or give, uh, uh, deliver a baby or they are hurt by a car accident or terror attacks. They are all the time with us and we in Magen David Dome feel their strength and their spirit. And I think this is the most important thing that people would know. We cherish the support, it's so important. We want to say a huge thank you to all of our friends around the world who have donated so generously to our Israel in Crisis Fund, which is enabling us to help Israel in these difficult days with a variety of aid, whether it's these medical equipment or shelters or aid for evacuees or victims of terror or a whole variety of uh, assistance that Israel can use in these days. We want to say thank you for giving so generously. Thank you.